my mom's going to be reading this book, The Mixed Up Chameleon by Eric Carl. Yeah, and today we're really going to be discussing um, the fact that we have to be happy in our own skin. Um, and we have to be ourselves and only ourselves because um, when we start wanting to be other people and try to be other people, it is inauthentic, ingenuine. It's not real, it's fake. And you can't really be productive or be true to yourself when you're not who you are. So that's what we're gonna talk about and learn about with the mixed up chameleon. He is so mixed up. Let's watch how crazy he gets. So again, The Mixed Up Chameleon by Eric Carle. I'll try to show all the pages. The Mixed Up Chameleon. Okay. So on a shiny green leaf sat a small green chameleon. I think he's right here, maybe this one. It moved onto a brown tree and turned brownish. It's right there. It rested on a red flower and it turned reddish. When the chameleon moved slowly across the yellow sand, it turned yellow greenish and you could hardly see it. That's what's really cool about chameleons is that they take on the color of whatever they're next to. When the chameleon was warm and had something to eat, it turned sparkling green. But when it was cold and hungry, it turned gray and dull. When the chameleon was hungry, it sat still and waited. Only its eyes moved up, down, sideways, <laughs> until, it, until it spotted a fly. Then the chameleon's long and sticky tongue shot out and caught the fly. That was its life. It was not very exciting. But one day, the chameleon saw a zoo. It had never seen so many beautiful animals. You can see a polar bear, flamingo, seal, turtle, elephant, giraffe, fox. Oh, a Oh, a fish. Yeah, a deer and some people. The chameleon thought, how small I am, how slow, how weak. I wish I could be big and white like a polar bear. And the chameleon's wish came true. But was it happy? No. Because it was big, it became big. That's what this picture's showing. I wish I could become a handsome, like a flamingo. And all of a sudden, he got wings and legs like a pink flamingo. I wish I could be smart like a fox. He got a big bushy tail fox. Yeah, and you can see what he is. He's already been a polar bear, a flamingo, and a fox. I wish I could swim like a fish. So he got fins. I wish I could run like a deer. He got the big antlers. I wish I could see things from far away like a giraffe. He got a really long neck. I wish I could hide in a shell like a turtle. He has a turtle on his, a turtle shell on his back. I wish I could be strong like an elephant. His face turned into an elephant. I wish I could be funny like a seal. Oh, he got the seal's legs or fins. I don't know what. The seals, legs, and fins are called flippers. I'll have to Google it. I wish I could be like people. Just then, a fly flew by. 
The chameleon was very hungry, but the chameleon was very mixed up. It was a little of this and it was a little of that and it couldn't catch the fly. Here's the people, the hat and the um, umbrella. And there's that fly, but he didn't have his long sticky tongue. I wish I could be myself. The chameleon's wish came true and it caught the fly. The end. So the chameleon took on all the traits that he liked about the other animals or that he thought were strong or beautiful or interesting. Um, and the thing is that the chameleon took on those traits that he saw in others that were appealing, but in himself, it just didn't work. He couldn't even eat. He couldn't do anything he needed to do to stay healthy. So when we're, um, seeing each other through YouTube and schools closed. Just remember to be yourself. Be yourself, you're the only one that's you. Be unique. Everyone has special things about themselves and you just have to find out what they are in you. Have a good week and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.